hive last year and also both of my hives this year, I've noticed they pack two frames together uh -huh. uh, where they're, they're sealing them so you can't pull them apart. Is that a good thing or should you keep them pulled apart? Yeah, so the bee spaces, uh, they're probably too close together maybe or, or they'll build a bridge comb. Sounds uh -huh. like they build a bunch of bridge comb from one frame to the other from the top bars to... Yeah, to like two of them I can, when I pull them out of the box, I pull them out together because I can't. Pull them yeah. apart without completely destroying them, you know. You, you know what? I I wouldn't insist on even taking them apart. If they're not up in your in a honey super mm -hmm. where you need to separate them so you can cut the caps off, extract the honey, I just leave it alone. Just leave them together. The you know, if you don't know what's going on in between those two, then it, it's probably not really going to matter. Okay. Just leave them together. You'll see a couple of these got a little bridge comb where they build off the foundation and in between boxes. I'm not trying not to get too fussy about it. If you catch it early enough, then I'd make them start over and, and keep them separate. Keep them straight. But now they've stuck everything together, just leave it. Okay. So would you just leave the space? Because mine did the same thing. Would you just leave a bigger space and pull out a... You probably had, yeah, you probably had too much space is why they did that initially. Maybe. The B space, so... So Mr. Langtrith, the one that invented the movable frame hive, he's the one that's credited with discovering the bee space. The bee space, of course, has always been there. It's about three-eighths of an inch. But he's the one that recognized it and designed a hive to use around it. So if they have more space than three-eighths of an inch, then they like to build off the foundation and, and build bridge comb and, and make a mess of everything. <laughs> So you want to line those frames up there evenly when you put them in there, not too big of a gap. Yep. And it's hard when you have all foundation to start because it yeah. is thicker than if they have comb built out, you know, to that space. So.